I'm Joanna. I've come to the CBeebies house to read you tonight's bedtime story, all about a little monster who just wants more and more. Tonight's bedtime story is called Blue Monster Wants It All and is written by Jean Willis and illustrated by Jenny Desmond. Blue Monster loved brand new things more than anything. When he was a baby, he said, I don't want my old pram. I want a new one. He wouldn't stop screaming until he got it. But it didn't make him happy for long. I don't want my old teddy, he said. I want a new thing to cuddle. And he threw it out of the pram. So his mum and dad gave him a baby sister. Blue Monster loved cuddling her at first, but he soon got bored. I don't want my old sister, he yelled. I don't want my old teddy or my old mum and dad. He took all the money his old granny had given him and left home to start a new life. Blue Monster bought himself a new hat. He liked it so much he wore it all morning. But that afternoon, he said, I don't want this old hat. I want something new. He stamped his hat flat and bought a shiny red racing car. He was pleased with it in every way. But the next day, Blue Monster didn't like it one bit. I don't want my old car, he screamed. I want to buy a great big golden palace with a funfair and a circus. Which he did. And it was wonderful. But only for a while. What I really need is a new aeroplane, said Blue Monster. So he bought a jumbo jet and flew off to a tropical island near New Guinea. This looks like paradise, said Blue Monster. So he bought the whole island and everything in it. But he didn't want the old animals who lived there. So he bought new gorillas, new polar bears, new zebras and a new submarine, so he could watch his new whales. That night, he climbed into his new hammock. I've bought everything I need to make me happy now, he smiled. Then he drifted off to sleep beneath the stars. Blue Monster woke up to a brand new day. His new birds were singing, his new bees were buzzing, the sun was shining, but he still wasn't happy. I don't want the old sun, he said. I want a new one. And he snatched it out of the sky and he ate it. Everything went dark. Blue Monster was cold and scared and alone. He really needed a hug, but none of his new things could comfort him. <laughs> Never mind, he sniffed. I'll go and buy myself a new family. But there are some things money Jess can't buy. There were no families for sale or friends. Blue Monster began to sob. He sobbed so hard, he spat out the sun. Suddenly, he saw the light. I don't need a new family, he cried. I love my old family. Blue Monster fixed his broken plane and flew all the way home to give his old mum his old dad and his old sister a good old hug. 
This made Blue Monster feel a hundred times happier than new hats, fast planes and paradise islands ever could. Because he had everything he could ever need. What a lovely story! Blue Monster learned that the most precious thing in the world is a hug from a loved one. So why don't you hug your loved one and tuck yourself in and I'll see you soon for another bedtime story. Night. Watch more on BBC iPlayer.